Toastmaster Satya Murthy. The title of his speech is Give It Some Time. Toastmaster Satya Murthy, give it some time. Over to you, Toastmaster. The lockdown had completed. It was very long time since we had social meetings. I got a call from my close friend of more than 30 years. Hey Sam, it's time. We need to catch up, seeing face to face. Yeah, sure, sure, Ramesh. That should we meet. Yeah, we can, why don't we go to a restaurant and uh, we can have something to eat and then meet up. Okay, so the meeting was fixed. We both were in the restaurant. Nicely air conditioned, the tables are beautifully arranged with social distancing. I ordered a grape juice. So did my friend Ramesh. Okay, I am not going to describe now my friend and his looks. It's not relevant now because the hero was the grape juice. There was small, medium and large glasses of grape juice available. I picked the large one. He also took a large one. And then I started drinking the grape juice. Finished it in one gulp. The entire 200 ml plus grape juice was done. And I looked at my friend. He was still sipping. And then he was staring at me. Sam, what is the urgency? Why did you finish it so fast? Yeah, we came here to eat. We are on the job. Let's finish it fast. My friend walked away to the stall where the juice was being made and picked up one grape and gave it to me. Sam, put it in your mouth. I put that grape into my mouth. He said, close your eyes and give it a nice bite inside your mouth. Is the juice coming out? I said, yes, the juice is coming out. How does it taste? It tastes very nice, very sweet. And I could feel the flush of that grape, single grape in my mouth. He said, now, slowly, slowly, devour it, eat it. Why are you in a hurry? You know, the taste of what you take is only until it passes your tongue and to your food pipe. The moment it passes away, the taste is gone. Sam, I've been noticing you all through. I'm seeing that you are always in a hurry. We have a very short life. Why don't you take things slowly? I see you when people are getting introduced to you, you are making a first impression about them and you make it as that, the lasting impression. And then you decide that this man will be my friend, this man will not be my friend. With this person, I will continue my relationship. With this person, I will not continue my relationship. Are relationships made in such quick time? Do you allow relationships to mature? Or you also treat relationships like the way you drink your grape juice? Friends, what relationships you kill at first sight? And why do you do that? Abraham Lincoln once quoted, I don't like this man. I should know him more. 
This is a fast world of social media. Likes and dislikes come very fast. We are in for instant results in whatever we do. Whether it is family relationships or friendships or taking decisions that change our life, most people try to do it very fast. Quick results. Have you ever looked at the woodpecker? The woodpecker takes a tree which is very strong and then it pecks at it almost 200, 300 times a minute, almost 20,000 times a day until it makes that hole. The hole was not made in, with single peck. Similarly, when you are trying to get water from a well, the well doesn't give you water at the surface. We need to dig deep until 30 feet, 50 feet, 100 feet, 150 feet, then water comes out. Relationships are like that. We need to select the relationships, but then allow the relationships to mature because life is not an instant. We all have same 24 hours with us, but what we put in those 24 hours depends on how we treat those 24 hours. How much time we get to mature the moments so that we can devour those moments. Next time I went to drink the grape juice, I didn't drink it like this. I took a sip, allowed the grape juice to move around in my mouth because I knew it takes time for things to mature and enjoy. What do you contest here?